السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته أهلا بكم مجددا ومع درس جديد من دروس اللغة العربية <coughs> Welcome all my students and my audience and we have inshallah today a new lesson Our lesson today talking about the النكرة والمعرفة النكرة والمعرفة which mean in English indefinite and definite النكره indefinite words and المعرفه definite words so like English, in english we have the we divided the words or the nouns two types uh, indefinite and definite and when we make it the, the words definite we add a or an or the the student and an or a or the so this is make the words definite in arabic the most of words it's indefinite words what's indefinite nakira so what is a nakira mean a nakira here is this is a noun or name الذي يدل على مسمى عام public noun okay example rajul rajul man ولد boy امرأة woman بلد country so this is called نكرة indefinite words or nouns and if we need to make it a definite word we can accept ال like the in English so we can say we switch رجل and became الرجل ولد الولد امرأة المرأة بلد البلد المعرفة the second type اللي تكون definite هي الاسم this is the noun يدل على مسمى معين we name for a, a معين يعني something uh, not public private وهي أنواع this is أنواع types so in general the in نكرة indefinite general and the uh, المعرفه definite it's private or special words so we have like six types of معرفه so number one الاسم or العلم so the noun or the علم i mean it like name of human mustafa that's definite ahmed muhammad aisha fatima so مصر a country القاهرة the capital مكة the capital also this is some علم علم the name we know it by this name second الضمير the pronouns so all the pronouns it's called definite like أنا I نحن we أنت you for male أنت you for female أنتما you for two male or female أنتم you for group of male أنتن you for group of female هو he هي she هما they for two male or two female هم they for group of male هن they for group of female so the pronouns it's uh, definite all the pronouns which is separate pronoun or attaching pronoun like تاء الفاعل نا الفاعلين نون النسوة ألف الاسنين كاف الخطاب all of this so number three أسماء الإشارة which called demonstrative pronouns demonstratives pronouns it's definite like هذا this وهذه this for female هذاني هاتاني for two male or two female هؤلاء uh, that or those for group of male or female so the demonstrative uh, pronouns it's called definite معرفة Number four, أسماء الموصولة. الأسماء الموصولة, we need by it the relatives pronoun. Relatives pronoun like what? الذي, who, or which. التي, الذي for male, التي for female. اللذان, two male. اللتان, two female. اللذين, a group of male. اللاتي واللائي, group of female. من وما, the public names, it's a relative pronoun. So, all the asma mausula or relatives pronoun it's called definite number five 
الاسم المعرف بال ذا نيم وي كان بوت ان فرونت ال لايك ذا ان انجلش اتل مي ذا ستودنت الولد ذا بوي المعلم ذا تيتشر الكتاب ذا بوك الامانه سو ذيس از ووردز اور نيمز ستارت ال سو ذيس از كول ديفينيت نيمز Last one from definite types, al ismu al mudaf ila ismu ma'rifa. When we add a noun in definite for the definite noun, both it's called isnad. So the noun first one he uh, after we add it for the second one he became definite. If we say kitab only, so this is indefinite. But when we add it to the one from those. Muhammad is a noun, like we say, alam. So, kitabu Muhammad, Muhammad's book. So, we said that now, kalimat kitab became ma'rifa, different. If we say kitabi, my book, we add it to the pronoun, and the pronoun is different, so he became a different kitab. Qalamuka, your pen. So, we add it to the uh, uh, attached pronoun, kaf. Qalamuka, your. Kitabu al uh, reading book. So kitab ul kira'ah, so we, the, the kitab is uh, indefinite, when we add it for definite, the name has al, so we became definite. Kitab hatha, we add kitab for hatha, ilhiya demonstrative noun, so became uh, definite. Kitab ul ladhi, we add kitab to ladhi, which relatives pronoun, so became uh, definite. So, uh, to know the ism ul nakira, how we know ism ul nakira? ندخل عليه أداة التعريف. We enter with, with L. So, معلم is indefinite. So, and we need to switch it and make it or uh, return it to the, the definite. So, we put L. L معلم. Uh, طالب. الطالب. أو نضيفه إلى معرفة. Or but add it to the معرفة like that. بيت. So, بيتي. My house. سيارة. سيارة أحمد. أحمد زكار. Now, we have some examples. Exercises and we need to know which word is definite and indefinite. Number one, معلم. معلم, a teacher, uh, our teacher. So just معلم. So you didn't have alif walam or is this. So it's called nakira. معلم. We put it with nakira. Tawila, table. So we don't have uh, l. So it's called uh, nakira. Tawila, nakira. Tawila. Also. She has uh, machines, so Nakira. So we didn't have L. Muhammad. Now it's a name, Alam, name of person. So like Mustafa wa Ahmed wa Aisha. So we put it with Ma'rifa. Muhammad. Okay. Taib. Alladina. This is one from the huh, relative pronoun. Alladhi wa allati wa allatheen wa allatheen. So it's Ma'rifa. Alladina. So also. Dirasa. Dirasa. Education, so uh, this is nakira, uh, sorry, nakira, nakira, indefinite. Also, we have nahnu, we, so this is one from the pronoun, and pronoun is definite, so nahnu is ma'rifa. Uh, Zaydun is a name of person, so it's called alam, so it's ma'rifa, Zaydun. Al-talib, al-talib has al, so the name start with al is ma'rifa al talib okay okay so haula this one from the demonstrative uh, pronoun hadha hadhi hadhan hatan haula so this is haula it's ma'rifa what's ma'rifa we said huh? definite definite huwa he so one from the pronoun huwa so yes so it's ma'rifa huwa okay kitab al shi'r the poet book. So, what this we add uh, uh, definite and definite to definite, so became musnad kitabu shar together or together kitabu shar it became ma'rifa alwa musnad kitabu shari it's called definite. So, this is our lesson today. An nakira wa al ma'rifa. We say in nakira it's public and the public and the uh, amma. And in Marifa, only three uh, six types. Marifa. I wish you understand our lesson today. And don't forget to make subscribe to our channel and follow us 
جزاكم الله خيرا السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته